What's up, what's up, GS350 JP in the house? Okay, I'm here with um, a uh, Japanese lady, and she is, uh, I think, 48 or 40. She's an older man. 49, I think. And I have some questions to ask her because I had one of my videos about over 40 videos, and I was talking about um, talking to the older uh, men in America and around the world that the women in Japan, as they get older, they still dress real nice and everything, still beautiful. And But um, I wanted to ask her about the um, sex lives of older women and what do they do. I know that the women that are like um, in their f maybe 45 and below, they're still, a lot of them are still active, but the ones over. So I want to ask her um, some questions and I'm gonna put this on YouTube only to, um, but I'm not gonna show her voice or, I mean, or face or anything. So, do I have your permission to put this up on YouTube? Sure. Okay, thank you. Okay, so in America, um, they're having a lot of problems with the men and the women. Mm -hmm. Black men don't date black women so much, and white men don't date white women. And, and I don't know if it's the older women or I know the younger generations like that. The older generation, I'm not sure, but I can't see the older de generation being much different, or a lot of them are single and stuff. So in Japan, though, I've noticed how uh, when I'm walking around the street, a lot of the older women are still dressing nice, still in good shape, still beautiful and everything. And um, and that kind of and I made and that made me make this video on um, called Over Forty and Over. And I was telling a lot of guys that the women out here that's over forty are still beautiful, and very attractive. But I want to know what is it? How is the sex life as you as them or you or whoever get older? I can't do it with the sex. You what? I can survive without sex. Wow. <laughs> wow. Why? How? How? I don't. I really want to do that. Oh really? Uh, oh, I really don't want to do that. Oh, you really don't want to do it. Yeah. Wow. So, okay, like, I'm young. Oh, I'm st well, I'm not young. Oh, I'm 48, I think. But I'm still thinking young. So, I think I'm like, when you go on a date, I know that it's eating and stuff. But usually, I, I from my experience, uh, sex would be included. You mean date? Yeah, like, go out to eat. Yeah. Yeah, date. Yeah. Not anymore for me. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's interesting. Oh, I'm not interested. Is it? Uh, having sex. But why? I don't know. I... Uh, maybe... I've been keeping my boyfriend uh, such a long time, you know, we have been staying there for about 70 years, so, <laughs> I don't know, that's the reason. Maybe when I find a new guy, I will change my mind. Wow. <laughs> oh my God, I, I don't know. <laughs> oh. oh. Okay, because I heard uh, from, um, okay, like my wife, mm -hmm. we don't have so much sex. I'm always trying, mm -hmm. but she's busy. She's always tired, but she also said that there is no excitement. So it's like when I go to her, just touch, want to, and she's like, no, wait, you know, make it more exciting. And do you think you, if you, it was more exciting, would you change your mind or... Like the come on, you know what I mean by come on? No. Come on is like, if somebody walks, okay, like uh, somebody walks up to you and says, hey, how you doing? Wow, you have beautiful eyes and wow, you have a really nice body and I like your style, you know, and while they're talking, they might touch your shoulders, you know, like, why wow, you have nice shoulders, mm -hmm. you know, and so that's like a come on, or like flirting or something like that. Mm -hmm. 
And so if it was, let's say if your boyfriend was to flirt with you, would that maybe change your mind, you think? No. <laughs> it's boring. Disgusting. Wow. Are you, you know, I... We haven't had a kiss. Really? <laughs> really? Never kiss. No. Oh, okay. We used to be kissing him a lot when you were, when we were, we met them mm -hmm. each other mm -hmm. for the past five years or wow. after that we stopped kissing. Wow. That's too bad. It's kind of disgusting. Are you serious? <laughs> yes. <laughs> or is it smoking or? No, he doesn't. Uh, but why disgusting? I mean, that's kind of a little harsh. We, <laughs> of course, we sometimes have sex, but we don't kiss. Uh -huh. Is that normal for Japanese people? I don't know. Um. My, I asked one friend at the Japanese. She told me she doesn't kiss her husband either. Uh, wow. You know, I, I made this video about um, love and... Oh, do you love black men videos? And I would walk up to Japanese women and ask them, do they love black men? And a lot of them would say yes. And then um, I would get these comments saying, well, a lot of people saying that they, before, they have to know someone before they love them. But I think love is not as serious as like. So you can love anybody, but like is more personal. And I think um, when it comes to kissing, even though you love the person you're with, to really kiss them after a while anyway, you would have to more like the person more than love the person to kiss them, is what I think. What do you mm -hmm. think about that? Yeah. Maybe I think so for yeah. the first time. Uh, okay. What about later? Um, like if, you, like if uh, your boyfriend wanted to kiss you, but maybe you love them. Let's say you love them. Okay, don't say if you don't love them. That's not nice. <laughs> but let's say if you love them and he wanted to kiss you, okay, then you might say no. But if you liked them and he wanted to kiss you, then would you kiss him? Or do you understand the difference between like and love? In American, love is, um, oh, man. Um, the um, love is more or less people are, um, I think what I think love is is the action that someone does mm -hmm. that you really really enjoy and so that's what it is but then um, like is, um, is a little more personal mm -hmm. so it's um, yeah it's a little more personal I think it's just a little more personal so if you like, let's say, like, if you, I think you love your boyfriend, but let's say if you liked him a lot, do you think you can kiss him? Do you understand the difference between like and love? Yes. Okay. I don't want to kiss him. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's it Sorry. for that. Oh, okay. What about, um, uh, do you talk to a lot of other women your age about? Yes. Yeah. What, what do they say? Mm, some of my friends, of course, kiss their husbands before they leave home or they come back to their house, mm -hmm. like all American stuff. But I can't do that. Oh. To my boyfriend. So, okay. So, 
I was thinking, like, um, I was talking to some guy. Well, not some guys, but in my video, I was saying, like, if the guys were to come to Japan, and it doesn't matter, black, white, whatever color the guys, even, you know, they got Japanese Americans in America to come over here, and if they meet a, a woman over 45, and they're still beautiful, still dressed nice, um, still look attractive. And if that guy would want to get into a uh, sexual relationship with her, mm -hmm. do you think it would be difficult or...? Depend on the person. Uh, okay. uh, I have a friend who likes to have a sex. Well, how does she? She's uh, the same age as me. Uh -huh. But one of my friends doesn't have sex with her, her husband such a long time. Oh. Wow. Like one year, two years? No, ten years. Are you serious? Yes. They have been married for about twenty years. Uh, wow. That's it. What, what, oh, go ahead. He's... Uh, her husband, he's too young. He must be 46 or 7. Mm. He's very healthy and uh, he can make a lot of money, but they don't have a sex. Wow. At home. At uh, home? Yeah. So we don't know he, if he has a sex outside of his house. Ah, oh, you mean like a relationship? Yeah. Relationship. Oh. Oh. But they kiss. Oh, yeah? <laughs> wow. Because I would, I would think if you kiss a person, it would make you want to have sex. Really? For me, if I kiss someone, maybe. It's, they're a good kisser. If they're not a good kisser, then it would turn everything off. If they're a good kisser, then I would, I would think about it. Mm -hmm. But because for me, I don't, I can't sleep with anyone, so it, uh, they have to really convince me. Okay. But um, wow, interesting. Okay, let's see anything else. Um, do you know? Okay, now, what about single women that are mm -hmm. older? Do you have any? Yeah, I have a friend. She's uh, single. She has a boyfriend. And how are... Oh, what I mean is single is like no boyfriend. Oh, really single. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Yeah. I have a friend. Yeah, and how does she go about her life? She says she doesn't need any boyfriend. Oh. She likes work. Oh, really? Well, yeah, yeah. I've met a few women like that. Even young women like that I've met. They don't care for a boyfriend or anything. And they just want to work. No, I don't know the, such kind of young people. Oh, yeah? Most young people I know have a boyfriend or married. Oh, yeah. Interesting. So what about um, like the um, foreign guys mm -hmm. that you know? Do they ever tell you about this? Who's married to a Japanese woman? Do they ever tell you about their experience, the ones that's older, or whether they are still sexually involved with their wives? They ever, no. They never tell you nothing. Really? About sex? No. No. With their wives, they don't talk to you like about that. No. Uh, okay, I guess I have to find some. Okay. Yeah. Usually, I don't. I have, I have a foreigner friends, but I don't know their wives. Oh, I see. And they don't talk about them? No. 